guys welcome to why run apps um, and uh, today we're talking about permissions or app permissions on your phone so this is obviously an iPhone with iOS um, and now every time you install an app it will require certain permissions or access to certain things on your phone so like Facebook requires access to your camera or maybe your um, well look even here look wallet requires access to your location why does wallet require access to your location okay they don't allow Okay, uh, so every time you install an app, you'll see that there'll be a pop up saying, I need access to your lo location, I need access, this app needs access to your uh, file system or your photo gallery or uh, your camera or your microphone, blah, 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 blah. So the question is, is how can you keep track of what's what? Now, if you're, you know, if you're kind of like um, a person who's very conscious of his um, privacy or data or privacy and protection then you should keep an eye on these things so here on um, iPhone on the settings if you go to settings you can go to privacy and you can see a list of all the potential um, privileges or access you can grant a specific app so for example if we go to photos what apps have access to my photos so Instagram and uh, Facebook right so you can say you can change the permissions never give access to Instagram or you can say give it read write permission so when you take a picture in Instagram it gets added to your photo library right and without this read write permission Instagram can't do that it can't add the picture to your photo library and the same with Facebook so you can actually mod or decide what you want specifically um, using these specific things um, on your um on your phone so here in the case of camera you can see that Instagram has access Facebook has access and decades the game decades has access because the game decade if you have ever played it, it takes a picture of your face to um, and you know modifies it and puts all sorts, all sorts of funny um, images over it and stuff you know to make you fit as a persona you know your character um, but do you want it to have access to your camera yes or no Facebook, yes or no. So you can disable and enable things from here for this, for the camera, um, for camera permission specifically. Um, and in previous videos, we discussed the microphone. You can see that they're both disabled because we don't, I don't want Facebook listening to my conversations or recording. I don't record audio on Facebook anyway, so it's fine by me. Um, but there's lots of permissions you can see here. So health kit, no apps have requested access to health. Uh, no apps have requested access to HomeKit, which is a smart um, smart devices, bloody bloody bar. So you can actually keep an eye on things. Even location services, for example, look, camera um, has access to um, location while I'm using it. While using the app, never. So you can actually turn it, turn off things and disable things. Wallet, remember, wallet just asked me for location privilege and I went no thank you and it went look so you can see smart says no but if you want you can turn it back on simple as that right system services wow man system services has lots of um things which access your location I think we'll have to discuss that in a separate one um, because we know that phones can are normally tracking wherever you go obviously because they're location based they have access to GPS which is built into the phone so they can actually tell you where you are where, when you were when and uh, we'll discuss that in a proper video actually um, but if you want to disable location in general you can just say uh, turn it off and it will turn it off for everything look it says turn it off Bloody location will disable be disabled for all apps but your personal location settings for all apps will be temporarily restored if you use find my phone to enable lost mode so that's if you lose your phone and you need to find it blah, blah 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 it will automatically turn on location settings to help you locate your phone but we're going to say cancel for now we'll turn it back on okay so there's lots of ways to monitor um what permissions what apps have so even even if i for example if i go to decades i can say go to decades what permissions uh decades is allowed to access your camera and CV search, which I don't know what the hell, not sure what that is anyway, but let's go to Instagram, for example. You can see Instagram is allowed to access read write permissions on photos. Microphone, I've turned it off. Camera, yes. Um, background refresh and Siri and search suggestions is allowed as well, I think. Yeah. So you can actually specifically go to the app that you want to disable, for example, Facebook, and say, turn off the camera, uh, enable the camera, enable the mic. Um, and you can enable the permissions for that specifically depending on uh, the app. 
but that's a quick way of controlling your privacy and like i said privacy has all all, all the actual permissions that are available on this phone or on this device and you can see what apps are using it which ones are not using it right so that's a quick and easy way to control access to your phone um to take control of what your phone is doing when you want <laughs> when you're not when you're not paying attention to it like i said people have said to me that facebook is listening to my conversation um even when the face the phone is off or on standby i mean on the table you're not actually using it but how did the, how is facebook giving me ads on a specific item that i've never searched for on the device or on any other device but it's i was discussing it with someone so is it listening to my conversation easiest thing is just to turn the mic off if you're not if you're like i said if you're just a, a follower and who someone who doesn't create videos uh, with audio and stuff like that but there you go take control of your app permissions and um know what your phone is doing and what is it tracking and what is it not tracking thanks for watching i'm going to do a video for android as well um, and i'll catch up with you guys in the next one thanks for watching peace out